Today is day two of the Soda Olympics as Team Trackmaster takes on Team Tomy in these race events. Representing Team Trackmaster, Steelworks Thomas, Shooting Star Gordon, Crash and Repair Salty, Steelworks Hurricane, Talking Racing Diesel, Lion Scotsman, Merlin the Invisible, where, do you, where is he? And Hugo the Rails Blin. And representing Team Tommy, Motorized Road and Rail. Real Steam Thomas, Extra Fast Thomas, Mavis, Rusty, Diesel, Duck, Toby, Edward. Edward with Edward's nose. As some of our viewers may recall, we just added batteries to these as we just unboxed them. And we've just added new batteries to all our track masters to make this Olympics very fair. First race, who's it gonna be, William? Which of these track masters do you want to compete first? Oh, whoa! Looks like Hugo's coming first. Hugo, we have new batteries in this guy. Hopefully he's not as slow as previous races. He'll be going up against one of the Tomy Motorized Road and Rail competitors here at the Olympics today. Which one is, oh, it looks like Jetpack, Extra Fast Thomas. From Thomas and the Jet. That engine, it is extra fast, Thomas. Let's get them going. Ready, Rip Run, ready to go. Are you ready? Ready, set, go. And they're off, and here they go. And it looks like extra fast, Thomas is proving to be extra fast. This is brand new batteries in Hugo. I don't know what's going on here. But extra fast, Thomas is proving to live up to his name. Extra fast, Thomas coming around now, just as a comparison. Hugo in the background, but it's extra fast, Thomas all the way. This has been a runaway event as extra fast, Thomas wins, while Hugo. Barely makes it around to the first go around here. Hugo, embarrassingly slow with brand new batteries. Second race of the first round, which one is it gonna be? Oh, oh, Merlin, the invisible engine, a great new competitor here. Which engine do you think he will go up against out of the Tomies? Toby, Toby from the Tomy. Tommy, Toby. Merlin versus Toby, let's get ready to shoot him off. Ready, to go. And they're off, oh, it looks like an early start for Merlin. But Toby is gaining ground. Look at this old fashioned steam tram is passing the invisible engine. Team Toby now in the lead as we go into the bend. Coming around the bend, it is definitely Toby going ahead of Merlin. Toby, 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 Toby. And Toby finishing. Merlin comes in a second, very impressive. Team Tommy seems to be dominating the competition. Even Thomas is shocked by these results. Third race now as Trackmaster tries to gain some ground. We have Talking Racing Diesel. This guy has been very fast in the past. Hopefully he can make up for some lost time today. Diesel versus Diesel. This is gonna be absolutely great. I guarantee one Diesel will win. We're gonna have to use a different starting technique. Are you ready? And they're off and they go neck to neck, toe to toe, face to face. Vicious to vicious, devious to devious. This is incredible. This is very close. It looks like Talking Diesel is inching ahead, but this is a very close race. These two diesels are going right off. Here they are coming around the bend and it looks like Tommy Diesel is now ahead, but he is very close. This is gonna be a very close race matchup. Who's gonna hit first? I'm not sure, but it looks like, oh, it looks like Talking Diesel. Talking Diesel won by just a nose. What a great race. Just a wonderful race as Trackmaster Talking Racing Diesel now takes over from Tommy Diesel. Very close race, just a nail biter on that one. Trackmaster now avenging those early losses. We're down to five contestants, five more races in the first round. Shooting star Gordon moving ahead. And who will he be facing off today? It looks like Edward Blue. Blue versus Blue. Ready, set, go. And they're off and it looks like Shooting Star Gordon is now shooting ahead. Those new batteries really putting out for him as Edward, unbelievably slow. Shooting Star Gordon now in the lead, coming around the track master while Edward is just coming in. Shooting Star now well ahead of his competition That's here today, why folks. They call him Shooting Star. Well, there you have it, folks. Inside analysis, Shooting Star finishes. Edward Blue, Steady Eddie, coming in second place. <laughs> It's now two Trackmaster versus two Tommy as we enter the halfway point of the first round of racing. And coming off representing Team Tommy, it's Mavis from the Far Car Quarry. And out of Team Trackmaster, it looks like Steelworks Thomas is rolling over himself with a chance to meet Mavis. We've had to do some slight track modifications because these Tommy engines do not work very well with the Mattel Trackmaster stoppers. We're gonna go ahead though, are you ready? Ready to go! And they're off and it looks like it didn't much matter about the truck modifications because Steelworks Thomas is well ahead and in the lead here. 
Mavis being a little bit embarrassed by her slow moving engine diesel. Whoa, while well, Steelworks Thomas is well ahead of the game. Look at him go, he is just flying. Unbelievable as he finishes. Look how far ahead. Oh, and Mavis. As we look down at Mavis, very kind, but the far corner quarry needs a strong engine, not a fast one apparently. Which track master are we gonna have now? It looks like oh, flying Scotsman coming from the mainland. Gordon's bigger brother. He'll be facing off against, oh, duck. We're going green against green. We hope the great Western way wins this one. Ready, set, go. And they're off and here they go. It looks like Scotsman well ahead. Wow, the track master engines. Tommy had a very distinct advantage going on to this, but looks like Scotsman well ahead as he enters the curve. Coming around now, ready to go. That's Here he is going. Duck, very, very slow. Scotsman well ahead, finishes well ahead of the competition. Flying Scotsman, yes he was flying. What's gonna be the next race here? We have two more maroonish looking vehicles. Oh, Hurricane's gonna rock us. And he's gonna go up against, oh, Real Steam Thomas, Metallic Thomas. This should be a very good race. Thomas will. Real Steam Thomas needs a little bit of a head start here just to keep him on the starting block. And they're off and it looks like, wow, it makes no difference. Oh my goodness. Whoa, Annie Dribbins, Real Steam Thomas. This is absolutely fantastic. Hurricane just entering it. Now look at him go. Wow, and Hurricane coming in very, very distant second here. Back to the steelworks on the mainland for you. So it looks like Crash and Repair Salty, a past champion, and Rusty, the narrow gauge engine. Let's have them off. And here they go, and it looks like, oh, Crash and Repair Salty well ahead of Rusty. Rusty must have some rust in his motor. He's going so slow. Crash and Repair Salty coming around, looking very aggressive here. Oh, yeah, Salty is well ahead of the competition as he goes forward and crashes. After the first round of racing, Team Tomy winning the first two races looked like having a strong lead, but only three other competitors make it to the second round. Facing off against Trackmaster Mattel, the new batteries really put new life into many of these engines. Five of them are going on to the second round. So representing the first race of Team Tomy, who's it gonna be? Looks like Toby. Toby from Tomy is gonna represent Team Tomy, and he's gonna go up against one of these five Trackmaster engines. Who's it gonna be? Oh, Steelworks Thomas, another perennial favorite. Let's get these guys on track and on time. Thomas versus Toby, Tomy versus Trackmaster, are we ready? Ready, set, go! And they're off, and here they go, and it looks very close. Right off the bat, it looks incredibly close, but I think Steelworks Thomas is just moving ahead just a bit. Now a full length ahead as he goes ahead, coming into the turns. Thomas going into the turns and coming out looks very you, good. Thomas. Oh, getting a little bit love. Here on the Sodor Olympics Raceway, he is well ahead. And he wins, coming in second, it is Toby from Tomy. Well, one Tomy already eliminated. This is not looking good for Team Tomy, but extra fast jet engine Thomas now. Coming forward to see who will be the next competitor. It looks like, oh, Gordon, shooting star Gordon doing forward rolls now. Are we ready? Ready, set, go! And they're off, and here they go, and it looks very close, but I think, oh, Thomas is moving ahead now. No, full length ahead, shooting star, not shooting ahead far enough. Oh, a double length now as he goes into the turn. Here comes Jet Engine Thomas around the bend. Oh, he is going way too fast for his own good. It's like a Jet Engine is behind him. And now he is on to the next round. Shooting Star Gordon eliminated. Well, it's hard to tell who the next Tommy engine may be, but our experts seem to think it might be Real Steam Thomas. But who is he going to go up against? Which Trackmaster engine brave enough to? Oh. Real Talking Diesel. Real Talking Diesel willing to take out one of the final members of Team Tommy. We'll see how he does going into the next round. And they're off and it looks like, oh wow. Oh wow, unreal. As he makes Real Steam going into the air, whistling all the way. Here comes Real Steam Thomas, dominating the competition. Diesel just now coming out of that second turn, or that first turn rather, and Thomas dominates. Real Diesel, do you want to go to the Great Race Show? 
silly steamies is wrong for you, sir. For the final race, we do have two Mattel Fisher Price Trackmasters, Crash and Repair Salty, a past champion, Flying Scotsman, a crowd favorite. To make things a little bit more even for the Trackmaster, we've replaced the Tomy track with the standard Trackmaster track. Just because we want an honest winner here, let's get ready to race. Ready, set, go! And they're off, and here they go, and it looks like Crash and Repair Salty moving ahead of Flying Scotsman here. Now a full length ahead as they enter the turn. Oh, Crash and Repair Salty comes around and he is out of the turn. Now Flying Scotsman, this is far and away now. We are really going ahead with Crash and Repair. Will he crash at the end is the big question, Ed. Crash and Repair, Ed. Scotsman. And here we have the final four. Two Tommy and two Trackmasters. Crash and Repair Salty, the only non-Thomas character in the final four here. Steelworks Thomas. Extra Fast Thomas and Real Steam Thomas going on to the next round. Who are we going to have in the first race, William, of the final four semifinals? Oh, yeah. It is Extra Fast Thomas from Thomas and the Jetpack, and he's going to go up against Steelworks Thomas. Only one Thomas can survive. Ready, set, go. And they're off. Oh, it looks like Extra Fast Thomas is ahead by a hair. It's a very even race, though. Looks like maybe Steelworks Thomas is gaining a bit of ground. It looks like they're even going into the turns. This is very interesting. I don't know who's going to win this one. It might be Steelworks Thomas going ahead. He is definitely ahead at this point, Steelworks Thomas. We're going to see who's going to finish first. And it's Steelworks Thomas advances to the next round. Unbelievable. Steelworks Thomas making it now to the final. Guaranteed a silver will race for gold. And the look of surprise on, and shock on the face of Extra Fast Thomas. He will race for the bronze. But let's get to our next semi-final match in the Tommy versus Trackmaster Olympics as Real Steam Thomas and Annie take on Crash and Repair Salty. Here we have Real Steam Thomas and Crash and Repair Salty. Let's get them ahead. Ready, set, go! And they're off! Oh, and it's pulling away, steaming ahead as Annie. Oh, Crash and Repair Salty putting up the best fight of all the Trackmasters, but compared to nothing to Real Steam Thomas as he makes that steam going around. Crash and Repair Thomas off in the distance, but it is Real Steam Thomas ahead as Crash and Repair crashes. We now have the setup for a gold medal match, the Battle of the Thomases, representing Fisher Price Battelle Trackmaster at Steelworks Thomas, and representing Tomy. It is the motorized road and rail real steam Thomas with Annie. Great race. But first is the bronze medal match as Fisher Price Mattel Trackmaster Crash and Repair Salty, a past champion, takes on extra fast Thomas from the Tomy Motorized Roll Road and Rail set. Thomas and the Jet Engine. Ready, set, go! And they're off, and here they go, and oh, look at this! Crash and Repair Salty pulling ahead of extra fast Thomas. Absolutely unbelievable, going for the bronze medal, it looks like it really is. Crash and Repair Salty coming around now, getting ready. Off in the distance, it is Extra Fast Thomas. Who's going to win this match? It looks like Crash and Repair Salty, and he crashes into the bronze medal as Extra Fast Thomas. Not fast enough. Not even Crash and Repair Salty expecting that thing. He went from a gold medal previously, or a Champions Cup, if you will, to the bronze medal here today. Here is Sir Topham Hat with the cup and Lou of the gold medal here at the Olympics. Only one of these can win. Steelworks Thomas, real steam Thomas. Let's get racing. Yeah! Woo! Ready, set, go! And they're off, and right away it is a one-sided race. Unbelievable. Real Steam Thomas. Give us a two, Thomas. Oh, almost becoming derailed, but still well ahead. He is off unbelievably fast. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. And it is Steelworks Thomas with the silver. Sir Topham had awarding the medals. Bronze to Trackmaster Crash and Repair. Salty. Silver going to Steelworks Thomas, but the gold medal going to the metallic real steam motorized road and rail Tommy Thomas. Being an absolutely fantastic engine, we're really pleased with his performance today. Well, that's it from the Sodor Speedway racetrack. We ho really hope you enjoyed this Olympic edition of Trackmaster Races. Give us a comment, a thumbs up, and please subscribe. Bye-bye for now. Thomas is like, what happened to you, Gordon?
I'm Black Bolt and I'm Shooting Star. He does look in shock looking at Shooting Star. Shooting Star looking rather shooting for a star. <laughs> That looks weirdo. That's a weirdo. You're right, he is a weirdo, but he might beat you. Let's race.